Hi everyone, I'm Andre and welcome to Bringing Brookfield Zoo to you. Today we are going to explore healthy play with one of our resident heroes, Officer Kirby. Let's take a look. Good morning Facebook. Uh, thank you for letting us bring the zoo back to you. My name is Lieutenant Barb and our star guest is K-9 Kirby. We're from the police department here at Brookfield Zoo and she's going she's one of our ambassador animals so what we use Kirby for is she does demonstrations she does agility work she does frisbee work and we're going to show you some of her tricks that she does let me tell you a little bit we have our own police department our first aid room and our own ambulance so Kirby is nine years old she just had a birthday on April Fool's Day April 1st she came from Von Lick Kennels in Denver, Indiana, and she found her home here. She loves to be petted. She loves kids. So when we reopen, I hope everybody can come out and visit our dogs. We also have another black Labrador, Charlie, and he's handled by Sergeant Tom Noga. So I'm gonna show you nose work, some of the things that Kirby likes to do here. Ready? What's in there? Good girl. Good girl. So Kirby just found a whole bunch of milk bones, which is one of Kirby's favorite treats. And then her other favorite is Kirby loves to play Frisbee. So we're gonna show you some Frisbee work. And also, we wanna start a birthday club with Kirby and Charlie. So, Sergeant Nogo will give me the frisbee. There you go. Ready? Touch it up. Good girl. Good girl. Bring it in. Bring it in. And drop it. Ready? Bring it in, drop it, one more for everybody, we'll see if we can get some height on her, uh, maybe not, Woo! good girl, bring it in, bring it in, so everybody and all our viewers out there, what you can do is help us support our animals at Brookfield Zoo by adopting Kirby and Charlie at the Share the Care. Yes, where does Kirby live? Kirby lives at the zoo. Uh, where in the zoo does she live? She is, she lives at the police station. And how old is she? Kirby is nine years old and she is a black Labrador. So when was her birthday again? April 1st. Uh, so what, what's Kirby's favorite thing to do? Kirby's favorite thing to do is play Frisbee. Uh, so what kind of things does uh, Kirby do here at the zoo? Well, Kirby is an ambassador dog, so she meets and greets kids that come into first aid. She's walked by all the officers in the park. She's trained to ride in the back of a golf cart. She rides on the motor safari trams, and she has a special cart that attaches to our mountain bike, and we can tow her all over the park. Does she ever get to meet any animals around the zoo? From a distance, we don't go up to any any animals. So if someone was going to come to the zoo and they saw Kirby, what's the best way that they could interact with her? First, we want to ask, have you ask the officer if it's okay to pet her and then put the back of your hand up to her nose. She'll probably give you a big old lick and then you can pet her, but always ask first. So do Kirby and Charlie get along really well? They are best friends. What is Kirby's favorite thing to eat? Probably milk bones. Milk, she loves milk bones and we train her on the scent boxes with milk bones. So how often is Kirby outside that the public would be able to see her? Well, with our chief, Mike Pandola, 
she's out a lot. She's more out than she's in her kennel. Do you get to go for walks around the zoo? Oh, she loves walking around the zoo, interacting with our guests. What's her favorite animal? Her best friend, Charlie. <laughs> How long has Kirby uh, been with the zoo? I believe six years she's been here. How does she like being employee of the month on Facebook every month or every other month? Every other month? I'm assuming they are very good employees if, if they're picked for the best, uh, best employee of the month. Uh, can you remind us again uh, what kind of dog Kirby is and why she's at the zoo? So Kirby is a black Labrador. She is at the zoo uh, as an ambassador dog and she likes to meet and greet and she especially likes kids. And does she stay at the zoo overnight or does she go home? No, Kirby and Charlie both live at the zoo because they're part of our animal collection. Uh, how does a dog become a police dog at the zoo? They are specially picked at our canine center, which is Von Lick Kennels in Indiana. Let's see, anything else? No, I think, uh, I think Kirby and I are pretty good. Yeah? All right. So thanks, uh, thanks everybody for your questions. Thank you, bye. That was great. What ways can you help a hero in your life? Let's check in with Jenny and explore some more. Hello, PlayZoo friends. My name is Jenny. Thanks for joining us for the Hamill Family PlayZoo video series, bringing the PlayZoo to you. Today, we will think about some very special people here at the zoo, our animal care specialists or zookeepers. We will celebrate these zoo heroes and think about our heroes at home. Let's go. There are lots of heroes at Brookfield Zoo. The groundskeepers and custodial crew work hard to make Brookfield Zoo safe and clean for its visitors. Today, we will learn about another group of heroes here at the zoo, the animal care specialists or zookeepers. The animal care specialists at Brookfield Zoo take care of the animals every single day, no matter what. Even when we can't see the animals, we know the animal care specialists are keeping them healthy and safe. The animal care specialists are heroes because they work hard to care for the animals. What are some of the ways that these heroes take care of the animals at the zoo? Animal care specialists take care of animals by preparing food and feeding the animals healthy meals. Good nutrition is important for animals and people to stay healthy. Do you have a hero at home who feeds you healthy food? Animal care specialists take care of animals by keeping their homes safe and clean. The animal care specialists clean the animal habitats every day because clean homes help animals and people to stay healthy. Do you have a hero who keeps your home clean and safe? Animal care specialists take care of animals by helping them to stay active. Animals need to exercise their brains and their bodies to stay healthy just like people do. Do you have a hero who helps you keep your brain and body active and healthy? Animal care specialists take care of animals by bringing them to the veterinarian for regular checkups. The vet makes sure the animals are staying healthy and gives them medicine when they are sick. Do you have a hero who takes you for checkups with the doctor and the dentist? Wow, the animal care specialists at the zoo really are heroes. I am so happy they take care of the zoo animals because I love the zoo animals and I want them to be healthy and safe. I wonder, how can we tell our zoo heroes and our heroes at home how super they are? That's all for today. If you'd like to share a thank you with a hero at the zoo, 
Send your message or a photo or video of your thank you to the address on your screen. And let's keep sharing our thank yous with all of our heroes. I wonder, how can we be superheroes ourselves? See you next time. We are committed to making sure all of our heroes are safe, healthy, and engaged, including you. This is why we're looking forward to seeing you next time on Bringing Brookfield Zoo to You.